think in this current climate, we don't know when we're going to get opposition. So um, we're actually quite grateful to get out on court and have an opposition apart from ourselves. Um, I think also the second one for us to really back up um, from the England series, really look at the areas that we were exposed in strategy wise. How can we build the combinations and get those relationships a wee bit better? So because of that and being so close to um, England, we've still got, I suppose, the feel of the morning um, that happened in our last test, but it's all good. Uh, just really looking forward once again to getting out there and seeing the improvements that we've made. We expect it's going to be more aerial and obviously quite physical with the, with the males and having for us to be able to compete on the ball. Um, but also I think in regards to our lines and angles, because we won't be able to get that ball lifted, we've got to do the work and the groundwork. So that's always really good, keeps us thinking, making sure once again that um, what are our gaps in our strategy, the capability of each individual as we head into selections as well. We were really disappointed not taking away from what England did, but really disappointed in the how of our performance, especially in the second half. Um, and I think, you know, the Sewer Ferns has been synonymous over the last two years of, of being able to grind out the win and just really fight. So I felt that we became really isolated. So that's one thing is really our strategy is built around the collective. And if individuals don't do that, then we're really exposed. And that's the floor basically so that clarity of strategy we've been able to do over the last couple of days has been better than what it was a couple of weeks ago that's one number two is it is selections to some degree um, you know we don't know what's going to happen uh, in the next round so every opportunity the players get out there uh, could be the last opportunity to actually play and then three not necessarily um, at the end, we represent and, and the Sewer Ferns, and there's a lot of expectation. I feel to some degree we let us down, ourselves down in that last series. So we got to do better, and that expectation and those standards have to be higher. So it's an opportunity for us to back ourselves and, and really stamp our mark um, and start walking the talk. And that's always a good thing for us at this moment of time, knowing we've got 10 months away for um, Commonwealth Games.